All right, cool. So I've now had the opportunity to play Halo Infinite on both PC and Xbox Series S. And there's a lot of people saying different things about the PC version. And I actually really like how the Xbox Series S version runs and plays. It plays really well. And normally I would make one of these videos to show you guys uh, some mouse and keyboard gameplay. Let me turn on this master volume real quick. So normally I would run through mouse and keyboard settings, which this game actually offers a ton of. Regular, you know, the, the good old mouse and keyboard stuff, mouse acceleration, all that stuff. But this is a technical preview and I've seen this already on Reddit and I think on Twitter. I thought I was the only one, but mouse and keyboard isn't working properly right now. So the first thing that I've noticed is that as soon as I go from right now, I'm on controller. So when, as soon as I switch from controller to the mouse and keyboard input, there's like a flash of what I think is the cursor, but then there's no actual cursor on the screen. I can move around my mouse and I don't see anything. The other weird thing is I can only navigate the menu with my WASD keys. Like I said, there's no cursor, so that's kind of weird. But the hiccups of mouse and keyboard don't stop there. I'm gonna go ahead and load into a match and show you a little bit more of what's going on with mouse and keyboard. Now, I'm not too upset about this because I know this is a technical preview. The game comes out on December 8th, I believe. So there's still some time for them to correct this. I just hope that they're made aware of it. I know people are concerned already and they're being vocal about it. Oh, we're not. it's not that big of a priority for them because we're on console and stuff like that. Now, mind you, this is only happening on console as far as I can tell. And I'm on Series S. I've seen some people say it has happened to them on Series X. And I think on Xbox One X, I've seen someone have this issue. But hopefully it's just a temporary thing. I'm sure they'll get it sorted out by the time the game comes out. And hopefully the cursor works in the menu. And we won't have to navigate with WASD because that's also kind of weird. But I'm making this because normally I give you guys some mouse and keyboard on console gameplay. And Halo Infinite is a new game. So I thought it would be a good idea to show that. At least for the technical preview. But, like I said, it's not working properly. This is Series S gameplay. We're gonna hop in here. The game looks and plays really well for this console. And it's a bummer that I can't use mouse and keyboard to show you guys. But this is basically me spinning around completely in a circle on a controller. And I'm gonna show you what happens when I go over to mouse and keyboard. So this game it lets you pick up the mouse and keyboard right away. I am now on the keyboard. E the keyboard inputs are perfectly fine. The issue is actually turning on the mouse. I'm right now doing a complete left to right, like full range motion, and it's just not. It's bumping into the edge of the screen, it looks like. This is me going full speed left and right. It should let me turn as far as I can go, but as you can see, it just bumps into the edge of the screen. It doesn't work. Um, keyboard inputs work perfectly fine. Sliding works fine. Everything on the keyboard side is, seems to be working as it's supposed to. And I've even gone into settings, to keyboard and mouse settings, and checked a bunch of this stuff to see if changing some of this stuff would do anything. Nothing has helped. I've also tried switching this mouse and using a different mouse. That also didn't help. So I think it's not really on my end the issue. It's going to be something New that's going to have to be fixed by them. And hopefully they fix it by the time the game comes out. Zone. This being a technical preview doesn't Zone really lost. bother me as much. And I can play the game on PC. But I just really wanted to do one of my normal mouse and keyboard control. videos on console. Enemy and I can't. So I have to show you guys this instead of it not working. Because controller works perfectly fine. It's not the game. And like it's definitely something with the console and the mouse and keyboard within the game itself because I've tried other games works perfectly fine the mouse works on pc I tried switching the mouse you get the same issue so it's not really anything that i have control over it looks like and if you're also frustrated about this issue i would not really like be too upset because like i said again this is a technical preview at least they're being made aware of the issue and hopefully they can get it fixed by the time the game is out but, yeah. now if someone knows something that i don't know and i'm maybe doing something wrong or if there's a fix within the technical preview i'd be happy to hear what that solution is for now i guess i will continue playing on controller for the remainder of this technical preview 
and whenever they fix it, they fix it. So that's that. And there's not much else to this video. Just know that there is support. Look forward to a fix, and I'll see you guys on the next one.